Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. I am going to do a reading for you. I know I've been MIA, guys, not feeling too well. On top of that, you know, my back. So, I'm definitely getting better, though. I missed you guys. It's a little sloppy. All right, let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. It's going to be today's energy, okay? I'm just going to do a quick one for you guys. Kind of see what's up. What's floating around in the ethers. Got the seven of wands, okay? This is standing up for your belief. Um, she's got a beautiful, beautiful, I just noticed this teal. Be strong in what it is you're doing and where you're going, okay? Some of you will work really well with a uh, uh, a teal, like a topaz crystal. King of Swords. So what this is telling to me, what this is telling me is that you need to stand up to the King of Swords. So when this person comes in to have a conversation, or if you're already conversating with this person, you know, stand your ground. That teal might help you understand the King of Swords. I'm not sure what that's all about, okay? Um... something going on with that teal the purple is pretty vibrant right now too Ten of Wands. Whatever happened between you and this King of Swords? Because you're the Seven of Wands. You're 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 the the fire energy. Okay, right now, and it's so important to stand your ground with this King of Swords. Whatever happened is is deep it's heavy to me deep um deep 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 anything else someone's doing some sorcery There's definite sorcery here. It's the Eight of Wands. 
This is some kind of communication. I don't know if it's between you and the ethers or you and this person. This is, um, this is heavy. She's, she's carrying the teal over here, too. That teal's been sticking out to me, too. I keep seeing, like, reflections of teal. And I, I've tried to block everything, and it's like I still see it. You know what I'm saying? So it's like I even, like, saw it on my hands earlier. So I don't, I'm not really sure what that's about, but... It's some type of magic. It's mysterious magic, but the female carries it. I don't know who's carrying the sorcery. But it's here. Two different beliefs, two types of different magic. Being presented in different ways. I really want to know what that teal is. Tell me about the Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands. It's the Nine of Cups. It, it's some type of wish. It, it's There's also a frog. Okay. I don't know if you've kissed a lot of frogs. You know that whole saying. I gotta grab a tissue, guys. Sorry. Oh. <sighs> um... I don't know if you've kissed a lot of frogs, you know, you guys know what I'm talking about that saying, I'm not quite sure what it is, okay, but this is like, stand your ground, um, you're both super religious. You both got people looking over you. Look at that in the background that I, I don't think I've ever noticed. It looks like your prince is coming. But you're going to have to stand, stand strong and tall when it comes to dealing with the King of Swords. So tell me about the King of Swords. This person is bringing stability, I guess. King of Pants. This one's been in, in faraway lands for a long time. They're solid. When they make a decision, they definitely make a decision and go for it, okay? Um, they're solid. They could be a business owner, entrepreneur. This one's coming out of the shadows, though. Tell me about the Ten of Wands. See, the two of you, I don't know if it's linked, but that's, it's deep. Whatever this is, is very, very deep. And there's that, like, that medallion I was talking about. Look at that medallion. Five of Cups. So this is, this is heavy. It's like her ships never came in type energy, okay? But her back is also turned. But they both look like both their heads are down. Very um deep. It's, to me, it's not even petty. You might get a message regarding the past. This isn't petty. This is This is just deep emotional deepness. That makes sense. Tell me about this Eight of Wands. So this is this is a message. Um, 
you're delivering, they're delivering, somebody's delivering. It's, it's so powerful. I don't think I want that one. The Hierophant and the Ten of Swords. Oh, look at that. Look at how... This is such a spiritual reading. There's definitely magic, but it's spiritual magic too. It's not just make pretend or someone trying to cast spells. It's not like that. But here's that teal. He or she is drowning in. But it, it, to me, this speaks about emotions. This is this is heavy, 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 heavy. Um. Okay. Well, I said I didn't want that one, and it literally slid on the table. So I guess I do want that one. That's that's a big message. I just got the goosebumps. So. This is extremely heavy energy. It's a tool of pence. She's beautiful. It's time. It's time for something. Can't run away. I don't know what just happened. But my screen just went blank. You can't run away from this. But it's it's time. This is balancing things out, okay? This is I'm just trying to get that in the picture. This is balancing things out. This is harmony. This is things coming together. This is a very, very emotional situation. Very deep. The emotions run deep, okay? Um, tell me about this Hierophant. It's the Queen of Pence. So now you got the Queen and the King of Pence. It's kind of like a life partner. I saw those keys somewhere. The Hierophant. See how she's holding it? And he's holding it too. So this is either a relationship. To me, this is spirit right here, okay? But it's like they hold the key. But she holds the key too to unlock whatever this is. If she if she dares. Type energy. Okay. Um I don't know what made me say that, but like this is like if she dares to open Pandora's box. Something was buried. But she holds she holds answers. She holds keys. She's no joke. She is no joke. So. Let me just get one advice card. This is definitely a slower reading, guys. Um, I don't know if, you know, I felt the need to bring that up. So I don't know if this is one of these things where you literally just got to go with the flow on this one. Um, overall message, please. Overall message. But this is, this is deep, deep, deep. It's a deep spiritual connection, too. It's a conversation coming in. It's do you dare. It's almost like do you dare. You better hold your ground. To me, it's, it's the woman, okay? It's the king of air again. All right, so now we got that person twice it says things are looking up the end of a difficult situation someone's taking a trip okay it's, it's the six of swords moving forward leaving stuff behind events that occur with great speed take your time carefully and review your options okay that's why I kind of said like do you dare okay um, this woman 
I believe it's the woman that's carrying the five in the cups. That's some deep shit. And there's that, that teal, I don't know what that teal is. It literally wants, I want to go to the store and go buy a, 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 um, a topaz quartz. I think I'm going to. Because it's been coming to me. See what I'm saying? It's that topaz quartz. And I don't know, I can see it on my hands kind of. I don't know if you guys can, if it's my if it's my aura right now. I'm not quite sure what it is. I saw it earlier. So, it might be, and I was kind of called to this deck. So, I think I'm going to go, I think I'm going to go to my crystal store. But this is, this is deep, guys. I know the topaz quartz, it's healing, okay? But it's got to be more than that. And this is coming to an end of a difficult situation. To me, it already came to an end with the tens. It already hit completion. See what I'm saying? Do you dare? It's strange it's coming at me like that. So do you dare to open that box again? Let's see what's at the bottom of this deck. Let's have five of water. Same thing. I don't think it has anything crying over spilt milk. Unless this other person is. Because to me, she's not crying over spilt milk. She's, she's ready to stand her ground. If she's ready to stand her ground, she is not crying over spilt milk. Okay. Um, so I, I don't know if this is linked to the gentleman or the, the female. I want to say the female though, to be honest with you. Or this person doesn't know how to, this hierophant, this other spiritual person does not just, does not how to send, does not know how to send you that message. Cause they hold the key too. Together you guys are super spiritual. It's just, it's deep. Deep, deep, deep. But it's like a wish coming true. I don't know if you look at it like that anymore. Luck is on your side if you believe in luck. This, No matter what religion you are, guys, this is deep. Tell me about the Five of Cups and the Ten of Cups. Five of Cups, Ten of Cups. Five of Cups, Ten of Cups. I feel like it's over with. It's already dead. So to me, that might be, it's just something getting triggered, possibly. Yeah, it's being you're being triggered with the with the fool, okay. And the five of swords at the bottom of the deck. Do you, it's like again? Do you dare? I don't know what that's all about, but can you have a new start? I, I don't. I gosh, I don't know if this person's gonna come in and challenge you, or if it's spirit that's challenging you. I think it's a little of both, cause it's like if that's spirit, they hold both of you guys as key. Like, don't get it twisted. Type energy, it's guided. You know what I'm saying? So nobody's got the up, upper hand over nobody. Very bizarre. But I'm sure if it's for you, you resonate, you know? Will you take this new stat? Someone's challenging you. Whether it's the divine or it's this person. You're both superior. I can feel it. Again, it's those it's the alphas. Do you dare? I love you guys. Have a fantastic day. Bye. So basically, sorry. Because, hold on, I got sidetracked. Space cadet type thing, you know? But 
it is today's energy within the, it's, it's fluent. Okay. So this is it either happened over the weekend or it was, it's, it's coming in. Um, but it really does boil down to a new start with this person. And even if it's somebody brand new, you had to have gone through a lot, a lot, a lot with somebody else in order to take on a new challenge. But to me, this is something that was already dead, all these tens, you know? So, looks like it could be something solid, okay? At one point, you know, it was just the King of Swords, and now it's the King of Pents. So, it's like, just look at these cards again. You know what I'm saying? Standing your ground. Don't forget to stand your ground when it comes to this King of Pents. Whoever this person is, family member, lover, friend, child, stand your ground. I, I don't know what that's all about. But this, like I said, this is deep. Deep, deep, deep. And this is like in the ethers too. But it's also a messenger. All right, but this person has something to say. And so doesn't this person. But see how deep it is? That I mean, that when I clarify, this is that's how deep it was. It's deep. It had already it, it was already dead. Two tens. I bet if you're seeing ten tens a lot, this has to do with a lover, because ten ten is about a lover and you both having the same goals. You you're both kinda right on track. So if that's the case, things are gonna fall into place. Because you both want the same goals. You're both about your higher purpose. See what I'm saying? So it's is deep. And I think that's why it's linked to the hierophant. Because it's, it's spiritual. They hold the key. Even though the tool you hold the key, they hold the key. So you're being challenged either by this person or the universe. I think the universe is challenging the both of you. But at the same time, they're letting me know that this king of swords, somebody who does not speak from the heart necessarily is, is how I'm taking this card right now. It is something that was already dead. This person's very analytical. Th th thoughts, thoughts, thought, 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 thoughts. Does not think with their heart. Now, do air signs think with their heart? Of course, but not this particular case. This is not what that was about, okay? Now this person's solid. Before, this person was probably unresponsive. But now solid is what they're saying. Do you dare, again, you're being challenged, do you dare open Pandora's box. I will tell you at one point, this was your wish. This person was your prince at one time. This was your prince charming. Do you dare? Do you dare? It's deep, guys. It's very, very deep. That's, it's like the same as the Ten of Wands. Deep, deep, deep. You're being challenged. You're being challenged, my little chicklins. I love you guys. And it was, you know, when I... Your best information for you, like your, your overall message, is again this King of Air. So you're probably dealing with an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Or somebody who's still coming in like that, but they want you to know... It is something solid, okay? It is going to happen quick. Take your time and just be creative when it comes to solving this. Again, do you dare? <laughs> I don't know who's challenging you. I think it's the two. I think it's I, this person and the universe is a challenge for the two of you. It's very challenging energy, you know? It's... Can you fix it? Do, do you dare? Like, I can't explain. I can't explain it. All right? But things are looking up. It is the end of a difficult situation. Okay? So, but that's, just, that's if you can let bygones be bygones. Again, it's the challenge. All right? So, I hope you're up for it. I love you guys. Bye.